Hello, my name is Bella. My life was a total wreck until he came into my life. He was the most amazing person ever, even if he was not one of us. But he was still a person. Maybe he didn't have heart or feelings, but I still fell in love with him somehow. It was a bright sunny morning as I was getting ready to marry my true love. And the place we were getting married in was the most perfect spot. Everything was ready and everything was perfect. Alice had everything ready and arranged perfectly. It was time for the wedding to start. I got up and then my stomach started getting twisted. And I started to get second thoughts about me and him. I don't know if it was because I was too young for him or because he wasn't one of us. But I kept pushing through the second thoughts and made it to the aisle. The music starts to play. As I began walking down the aisle feeling frightened, wondering if I'd ever be like him or will he turn me into being him. My dress hitting the green grass and the tail drying behind me, bringing up the grass. But other than that, everything was perfect. But who knows? My dad's to the right of me, happy as always. But I still had that feeling that something was up, but I didn't know. My dad looked amazing in the suit he was wearing. But it was the one he got married in to my mom. I seen Alice smiling ahead of me, and I smiled back. Then I look over, and there he is the man I was marrying. We approached the ordained person that was marrying us. I walked closer and stood there and looked down. When I looked up, Edward had blood all over him, just smiling. I looked to the crowd and everything was, everyone was covered in blood. I just stood there in shock and wondering why did, did this happen. Because, could it be because he's a, the wedding was over and it was time for our honeymoon and he was taking me somewhere that was a surprise. The plane had landed and we were getting off we drove for a few and it was time to see where we were staying at. The house was perfect. Too bad we won't be staying here for walk. One week passed and we had to leave because I wasn't feeling right. We get back and forth and I noticed that I was looking the same as I used to be. So I started to look closer and as we're close in the room, he was like, I have news. He said that the plan we were having is now taking into effect. And he said, if you want to know what the plan is, read the book. 